Hello everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to it if you're new. Today we're gonna be our the re <laughs> sorry. Today we're gonna be reacting to the Five Nights at Freddy's official trailer for the movie. And uh yeah, this trailer is only forty seven seconds long, so I'm kinda I, I don't know how to feel about that because kind of shorter means that there's not as much. But they might have a fast paced trailer here for us. And so, yes, without much further ado, I don't want to waste too much more time. Let's just get right into this, shall we? Move my mouse. Welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria, oh, where the fantasy and fun come to life. Hit it, guys. It would have been cool. If, video, oh. Okay, shh. It means Hold on. you've been selected as Freddy's newest security guard. Oh, wow. <laughs> Very kind of high tech. It looks like the so ooh. much fun together. Oh, all right. <laughs> that was actually quite a bit. Uh, let's see, kind of. So this is kind of the beginning, kind of like introducing us to it. I will admit, I like the VHS style that they have for it because it's quite cool. I like it. it. Reminds me of those like VHS like analog horror type things that people make nowadays and all that. But they've probably been around for a while now. But yeah, we see this employee, which any way that I can. No, okay. <laughs> I'm trying to see how I can upgrade. Uh. If there's a way to update the quality. But she has like a good bit of badges. There's pizza. I know that there's the Let's Eat. That looks like Bonnie. Possibly the Cupcake. What's her name? I can't... <laughs> Anybody that knows her name, I would like to know that. Rhea, we're fam okay, so we got the kids eating. And parents at the tables. Oh, uh, that looks like the security breach door, actually. <laughs> I don't know why I saw that, but I did. So that's actually really cool. So it feels like an actual place, which I mean, I guess is the vibe they're going for. Like in 90, 80s, possibly 90s location. Got arcades. <laughs> Some, oh, uh, it's not that like shooter game where it's like you are a spaceship. You gotta shoot those little aliens, whatever they are. So we got the ball pit, which comes in play later, unless there's multiple ball pits. You know what would have been cool? A into the pit reference <laughs> I don't know why that would fit how that would fit but that would actually be really cool but yeah oh, <laughs> a little too far so here's the showtime button which I kind of figured they would have like an actual like panel for it like you know like a switch but a button works too why not <laughs> I thought they'd have like some kind of control panel for the show stage and showtime stuff so but that works too i suppose now this is what i was actually gonna say i kind of wish that they had like the security breach uh showed not security breach um the help wanted showtime thing playing because to me that would be actually really cool and pays a mod to that but <laughs> i don't think sky would have approved it but yeah, here's like the actual like first look of the animatronics. Very cool. <laughs> Bonnie's just giving like a blank stare like, I see you over there. <laughs> oh dear. I... These actually look very good. Like, I think most people were like skeptical on whether or not the animatronics would have looked good or not. I mean, they actually do. I mean, Freddy looks a little, uh wide in the hips here but <laughs> a little bit wider than his torso him and chica i don't know if bonnie has the same case but still anywho let's <laughs> stop looking at animatronic hips that's odd but and uh yeah oh closed wait so at the time that this is occurring is Freddy's actually closed by now. Because it seems a little odd that it's 
showing this and then followed up by who I'm assuming is the yeah night guard Mike at Kitchen State Security there. Does it actually like closed and if so, how long actually? Oh, that I just realized like the building in the back's the one that they constructed, right? But ended up taken down a few weeks later. <laughs> uh, that's interesting. But yeah, okay, it shows that for a few seconds and then as I've stated, Mike or if you want, just call him security man. <laughs> security guard, security man. Yeah, let's see. So he just walks in and looks around the place. Hmm. I gotta admit, like, the more they add to pan uh, the FNAF 1 map, the more it makes sense. Kind of like in Help Wanted, they add the prize corner. That actually made some sense, you know, kind of, <laughs> kind of fits, right? So, let's see, they got tables, which I actually like the little, uh, what is this called? Like, the little glass, right? Like, it's glass panels of sorts. Kind of feels like a Chuck E. Cheese-esque thing, too, which I kind of feel like is kind of the vibe they're trying to go for. Still. Uh, they got this here, which might be like a receptionist desk. I really can't tell. Yeah, it looks like a cash register right there. So, maybe. So, he goes here, checks on the animatronics, which that is... Wait, go back a little. <laughs> Imagine just seeing Bonnie... Sting them. You know what would be cool? Him just turning like split second. But he doesn't. So he checks the animatronics out. Turns on the power. And things were to life. Which here's kind of an interesting thing. Freddy has gloves. On this thing. I don't know if anybody's uh, you know said anything about that. But it looks interesting. Definitely a new design. And as of now, I don't know if I like it, but I feel like me personally, I'll grow on it. I think a lot of people would definitely grow on the gloves and the red eyes. That's also something a lot of people have talked about recently. I've, I've seen that. All right, so we got the office. Oh, they actually got the like iconic celebrate poster which is mwah chef kiss <laughs> but all right let's see we got let's see so we got like the pixar lamp <laughs> some uh, notebooks cups stuff like that so this isn't like a monitor right like you know how we have in the games and all that or even like help one it's monitor screen so this is actually like one of those official mall like camera setups which is interesting and i'm actually curious and i don't know if anybody who's watching this would know how does this operate right like i feel like this little joystick is to move the cameras around whatever but how do the buttons work like is this like cam you know like the letters like what is it like so, like, the letters and numbers, pretty much, like, 2B or 1A, you know, stuff like that. Okay, so it cuts to this screen, which, what is that? Like, I know this is the show stage and supply closet, I believe. That would be that room. Yeah, because that's the uh, cleaning, well, there's cleaning surprise in there, obviously. But what's this? I don't remember seeing, like, a utility hall type thing in FNAF 1. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know. Uh, let's see. He's looking around. Oh, and Freddy showed up there last second. What are you doing, Frederick von the rest of third? <laughs> yeah, he's just right behind the mic. Just giving him that stare like, I don't know who you are, but I'm going to get you. Uh, y you might want to go, my dude. <laughs> you might want to move. And then just... Now this is a... Now that's a cool shot. I like this. It, it's terrifying, obviously. Honestly, this gives much more of like a serious tone to it. 
Like imagine getting strapped to a chair and this comes towards you. And then a lot happens afterwards. So we see Foxy silhouette on the door. Has to a little girl, which I believe she has been uh, confirmed, correct? Like Mike's little sister or whatever. Which, I, why is she here? <laughs> That's what I want to know. Why is she here late at night? Was she sat in the car sleeping or something? Like, <laughs> I don't know. Oh, Freddy activates. <laughs> and I'm just kind of pushing things aside and just continuing. I just don't want to make this too long. Anyways, we see Freddy slowly activate that girl, these people here. I'm curious, wait. There's five kids. And there's a possibility Golden Freddy is in this movie. So we could have the uh, missing kids victims right here. Because that's a girl. With looks to be blonde hair. A kid with a hat. <laughs> a kid in orange. Which, I'm gonna go out on a limb here. This might be Foxy's uh, kid here. And then that might be Bonnie and Golden Freddy's kid. I don't know. It it kind of matches up. Ooh. I, I saw him on a little first watch. Uh, this would be Purple Guy. Or Willie Mafton. However you want to really say it. <laughs> He looks like a consultant, like, or a principal being like, so, <laughs> little Timmy, he's got bad grades, and I wanted to bring you in to, uh, discuss that. <laughs> then we got Mike, and whoever this is, potentially. <laughs> Foxy shut up split second. Again with the little girl, going into here. And, wait, who was it that saw me? Bonnie. That's who I thought. Okay, and Freddy. Somebody said this in a comment. They do look kind of high. <laughs> Which I'm hoping that they change it. Not because I don't like how it looks. Just <laughs> because of that comment. But uh, yeah, that has been the Five Nights at Freddy's movie trailer. And uh, yeah, comes out October 27th. Uh... Not really much else that I have to talk about really here. Or not much else that I have to say about this, really and truthfully. So, uh, yeah. I guess that's where we're going to end it today. Uh, let me know your thoughts and opinions on this it, down below if you choose. And, uh, yeah. Anywho, this has been your captain speaking. I hope you have enjoyed. If you did, I hope to catch you all around in the next one. And until then, stay chaotic, but not too chaotic. And, uh, yeah. Bye-bye.